That's where CBS 42's Shanna Steve Myers joins us now. Shanna Steve, may the force be with you. What's the unique event <laughs> out there? <laughs> You too, Ken. You know, there is everything out here at Imagicon 2010, from Star Wars to Harry Potter. I spoke to Luigi from Super Mario Brothers a moment ago. He's searching for the princess, of course. I am joined by Darth Elvis. King Sith, baby. How you doing? How you doing? What do you think about this event? Well, I think it's one of the funnest kind of compilations and blending of so many different genres. You got anime here, you got fantasy, you got authors, you got um, artists really wonderful works of art paint wise and everything plus some really great costumes now let me ask you this what what is the motivation here darth elvis why why this well there's a there's a rumor that uh they actually cut elvis's head off and uh, froze it uh -huh. he wanted it frozen well elvis's head got a uh, upgrade from the empire so i'm just happy to be out of the grave for a little while <laughs> Whoa, we are uh, happy that you're out of the grade, too. Um, up on the third floor, like you mentioned, there's a bunch of celebrities up there. There are artists. There are also authors. The artist who does all of the artwork for Dungeons & Dragons is upstairs on the third floor. And then in the basement, there's a bunch of gamers down there. And then later, the after-hours party is going to take place at Old Car Heaven. Now, I'm going to go upstairs and take in some of the enjoyment. You too? Actually, I'm going to get ready for that nighttime enjoyment. Okay, well, that's what he's going to do. And then I will have much more coming up tonight on CBS 42 News at 10. Reporting live from the McWayne Center, Shane Steve Myers, CBS 42 News.